Let me tell y'all something. The best advice you will ever receive in your life will come from a crackhead. And I live in Florida. Our crackheads are top tier. They are built different, so I know firsthand. I was just at the convenience store trying to get some ice, and the guy going in in front of me was arguing with the crackhead outside. And I know y'all going to be like, Jasmine, how are you going to assume somebody's a crackhead? Because he was yelling at the guy, stop staring at me because I'm a crackhead. Something inaudible. This could be you one day. So the guy said something I couldn't hear and was like, and I don't do crack. And then the crackhead was like, well, you do something sagging so skinny jeans with a belt on. Now I'm high rule number one of interactions with a crackhead you never amp them on so now he like oh yeah you like that <laughs> you thought that was funny so now he yelling after the guy in the store he was like why didn't you hold the door open for the fat bitch now I want to go cry in the car cuz what the fuck did I do to the goddamn crackhead to deserve some sort of shit like that so as I'm coming out the store, he's like, I think I upset you. And I ain't mean nothing about what I said. You know, the weight looked good on you. I fucked a lot of fat bitches back in my day. Oh, so I was built for the crackhead gaze. My mental health is doing numbers right now. And he was like, and always remember, you don't have to be going on a trip to say bon voyage. So I was like, what does that mean? Rule number two of interactions with the crackhead. Never ask them questions. And he was like, what you mean? Bon voyage. And I was like, okay. And he was like, what you slow? Or something so as I'm driving home thinking about the fact that I was just called slow by a fucking crackhead I came to the realization he's right you don't have to be going on a trip to tell somebody bon voyage <laughs> bon voyage bitch <laughs> bon voyage